All right, welcome back to this Madden 24 Superstar mode. We are getting ready to head into week two against the Eagles. But before we start this video, as I finished last game, as you know, we ended up losing to the Buccaneers. As I was getting a thumbnail, EA turned their servers off for maintenance, which means the game didn't save. So I had to go in and I had to play it again. And if we go here to the schedule after Madden takes five years to load, even though we're on next-gen consoles, um, you will see that we ended up winning it. Um, it played, too. Oh, it says I played it two times. There you go. But it, it didn't save. Um, but, yep, we ended up winning in the um, rematch. I ended up playing, and I ended up having an amazing game. Kirk Cousins played terrible, as usual. Um, but rushing-wise, I had 29 carries to 220 yards and three touchdowns and receiver wise Jay Jetta's three catches for 97 yards I only had 38 yards on the ground um, I mean in the air and I had a touchdown so that is it we ended up winning the game so instead of starting the season 0-1 we are now 1-0 and and before we head into these drills I'm gonna have a poll in the top right hand corner of the screen I accidentally hit a button top right hand corner of the screen it will be a poll on what you guys think my franchise team will be I already have a team in mind but I will put four teams in there, and you guys can, can guess which team I will be starting a franchise around. Or maybe the most votes might be the team I pick. I don't know. I haven't chosen a team yet. I have a team in mind, but I'll put some other options out there. Anyways, on the field drills, um, let's do Oklahoma Drill Dummies minigame. Evade the defense and make it to the end zone. Um, plus five trucking. I'll do it. Alrighty, evade the defense to score as many touchdowns as possible. Um, this actually might be difficult. This might be very difficult because I can't go out of bounds. Um, okay, nope. You, if you just get him stuck on the little thing, I should be able to. Uh, nope, I went out of bounds. Okay, never mind. Never mind. That is what? How am I supposed to? Is that I, 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 I spun there and my guy didn't spin. See, I'm spinning. Why am I spinning in slow motion? This one is not fun. Yeah, see, like, I can't evade him. Like, my juke is so slow. Like, why am I juking so slow? Madden. There, there we go, and I'm still probably not going to thank you. This is ridiculous. <laughs> These mini games are so difficult for no reason. Go to the outside, and he, he still catches me with a stupid diving tackle. Watch, juke. Can't go nowhere. Oh, 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 toe drag. Uh, and I still don't have, how much is it for gold? I should be able to get gold on this. Should be able to get gold on this. Please. Okay. I got gold somehow. This drill was stupid. Look how slow. Okay. I need to upgrade my juke. 100%. All right. Um, I got plus five trucking. Bonus workout. Um, we got plus. F Let's do break tackle. We'll do break tackle training. And now we are good to head into this game against the current NFC champion Philadelphia 76 so let's head into it and see if we can get this W they're in 86 overall and they lost their opening week game and this is a prime time game um I have a plus five truck plus four break tackle heading into this game let's see man it takes so long to load dude for next gen this is insane um it is going to be a Thursday night football game let's get it all righty here we are Philadelphia Pennsylvania for this game on Thursday night football against the Eagles. There's C.J. Lewis stats from last week. Let's get it going. We're going to start off with the ball here, and we're looking to start off this season 2-0. and uh, We have Super Bowl aspirations with this team, all right? I know I got drafted. I'm only a rookie, but this team has Super Bowl aspirations. I expect us to make a run. I think this team is definitely good enough to make the Super Bowl. Uh, win it, I don't know, but make it 100%. I didn't know where to go there, but uh, that's a no-yard rush. No, I won't lie. Kirk Cousins has been awful passing the ball. God-awful. But we're going to give him a chance here. And, yep, I'm, I don't know how I caught that. That should have been picked, but Kirk was taking too long. All right, third and inches. I'm taking the risk of uh, running it, knowing I'm probably going to end up losing yards. Uh, I almost did. Fuck your cock. Could not grab me, but we get the first down. Third and nine now. I have not been able to run the ball on this defense. As you can see in the top right, I have three yards. Three yards on three carries. Kirk Cousins under pressure. He completes it, and we get the first down. 
We're faced with another third and short. I'm not going to run it this time, though. I'm going to hope myself for Hawkinson can get open. Um, he throws it, and it's incomplete. All right. I'm not sure if we went for it. I think we went for it. But we are now at the Eagles' 14-yard line. In great field position, K.J. Osborne gets the block. And C.J. Lewis is in the end zone for his first touchdown of the game. Third and three after I lost the yard. I'm going to be honest with you. Our offensive coordinator is just brain dead. He is suggesting the worst type of plays. Good pass, Kirk. I didn't even have to call for it. We're going to get the short gain and get the first down. All right, third and six here. Uh, Cedric Lewis had a pretty big run um, on this possession. But what What was the what? I hit my mic. What was the mindset there when you threw that ball, Kirk? What was it? I want to see this replay. He just threw it directly to number 45. Directly. There was no one open in the vicinity. He threw it right to Jones. I'm assuming that's Deion Jones. What are you doing? And the Eagles immediately go down and score a field goal. I don't know, Kirk. What the? Can you hike the ball, please? I'm hitting X. I'm hitting X. There you go. That's actually a good pass to Justin Jefferson. He gets hit in the back, but great completion. All right, here. Justin Jefferson looks like if that safety plays up, Jefferson has a touchdown. He played up. Kirk, please. Wide open. JJ has put. Oh, my God. Kirk threw a bad pass. He would have been in the end zone, but good catch from Justin Jefferson. If Kirk just threw that a bit more, he's in the end zone. But, I mean, if you let it a bit more, he's in the end zone. But, nope, he is not. Cedric, Cedric, CJ Lewis, big run there. Gets the first down. First and 10, KJ Osborne's on a pretty decent post route. Depending on what that corner does, that could be a touchdown. But he kicks it out to Jordan Addison. I'm fine with that. Uh, we're going to auto to this because Jay Jettas could get open. I know that corner's playing under, but uh, you never know. He's going to kick it out to TJ Hawkinson. And we're in the end zone. Touchdown, Vikings. We're going to extend this lead to 14-3 to on the reigning NFC champs. Oh, TJ Hawkinson wide open down the field. What a play from Kirk Cousins. Oh, my God. What happened to his head? Why does he look like that? His face is pushed in. What happened to TJ? Am I the only one that saw that? What a dot from Kirk Cousins to Hawkinson. It gets us... Close into field goal range, heading into the two-minute warning, and our O-line did absolutely nothing. Here we got a third and 11. Um, I'm on a decent route. I can't see Justin Jefferson, but I'm going to put him on a streak. They have Darius Slay on me. Um, he's not going to find anyone. He's going to throw it away. Uh, I'm not sure if we're in field goal range, but I feel he's 38. That, I think that should be plenty. I don't know who the Vikings kicker is. But once it lets me skip this, we'll be able to see if we can get that field goal. And we do. Last play of the first half. We are going to be going into halftime with a 17-3 lead. CJ Lewis is going to have 15 rushing attempts, 73 yards, and a touchdown on the ground going into halftime. Oh, Jordan Addison is wide open. What a dot. Kirk Cousins is throwing dots out here besides that one interception. We were backed up, third and 13, and Jordan Addison breaks free, gets wide open, and I'm going to run directly into a defender because we can't block for nothing. Third and four, Jay Jettas, you're going on your streak. You're going on a streak, Jay Jettas, and I'm going to put, I'm assuming Jordan Addison's back there on a streak too. Go, Justin Jefferson, throw it to him, and he didn't throw it high. Fourth down. It's sad how we can go from straight Kirk Cousins dots to awful decision making. It's just sad. I'm not going to have the speed to outrun most of these guys. I can't I don't even have enough speed to outrun um, edge rushers, apparently. But I'm going to get a decent amount of yards there. Second and three here. Sixth and second and short. I am going to run it here. No, I'm not. I'm going. We're going with a dagger. Jay Jettas. Can he get open? Kirk. He's not going to get him, but he gets C.J. Hawkinson open for the first down and a little bit more. Third and seven. I want a score here, or at least a field goal, because the Eagles are still very much in it. A minute left in the third quarter. It is a two-possession game. Kirk Cousins gets sacked. Oh, my God. And the Eagles didn't score. Five and a half minutes left in the fourth quarter. We are now have full control over this game. C.J. Brother, I can't run through this this defense, bro. I have players like I forget who number ninety is. 
Uh, it just I was drawing a blank in my mind. But it's I can actually check. I have players like Jordan Davis just chasing me down. I am a running back, by the way, if you forgot. Jordan Davis is a defensive tackle. Great run by CJ. Is a defensive tackle, and I am getting chased down by them. It's just embarrassing. I have 89 speed, which is low for a running back. But, brother, I should not be getting run down by defensive linemen. It shouldn't be happening. Another good run from CJ. Jesus Christ, dude. They get into the backfield so quickly. Bro, the amount of negative plays we've had in this game is absurd. Take a kneel. Take a kneel and end it, please. End my suffering. Because, good lord, this O-line is just abysmal. Jesus Christ. We're going to walk out of here with our second one of the season, moving to 2-0. 17-10 to victory. Uh, decent performance. I had 125 yards at one point. Uh, I had 25 rushes, 125 yards, and I lost 12 yards in my next four rushes. Because that's just how bad this O-line is. Play player stats. Uh, Kirk Cousins, 17-24, 189. A touchdown and an awful pick that could have easily been avoided. Uh, Jalen Hurts, 13 for 25. And a touchdown, only 148. Uh, Rushing-wise, C.J. Lewis, 29 attempts, 113. I, w I had great numbers for averages until I had 18 straight plays of just getting yards for loss. So that's pretty damn annoying. Uh, Receiving-wise, TJ Hawkinson, it was a pretty balanced effort. 55 for TJ, 44 for Jay Jettas, 39 for Addison, and 36 for CJ Lewis. Uh, blocking, sacks allowed, 1, 2, uh, 2, I guess. Uh, in defense, how many tackles for loss? Jordan Davis had four, and Hassan Reddick had three. Josh Sweat had three. Brandon Graham had two. Justin Houston had one. And Jalen Carter. So they had one, two, uh, three, five, eight, eleven. They had 15 tackles for loss in this one game. Fifteen. Well, we had what, two? Yeah, two. We we had two tackles for loss in this game compared to that 15. Unbelievable, man. Oh, it's just embarrassing how bad this O-line is. Anyways, that's going to be for me. GG.